Let's look at the lesson. Fewer, equal, and more. It would like us to look at this group of dolls. Now select the group that shows fewer. Fewer also means less. So I'm going to first count to see how many dolls we have. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, so I'm going to write a six up here just so I don't forget. We have six dolls. Now I'm going to count the other groups and see which one has fewer. Here I see one, two, three, four, five. Ah, so this group has five. Let's count the next. One, two, three, four, five, six. This group has six. Here we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This group has seven. All right, looking at this, I know that I want the group that shows fewer. So fewer means less, not the same or more. So I know that it needs to be the number that is smaller. And I know that five is smaller than six and smaller than seven. So I know that this group here has fewer dolls than this group up here. Now they want us to look at this group of tricycles. Now select the group that shows fewer. Again, we're looking for fewer or less. Let's count how many we have. One, two, three, four. I see four tricycles. Now let's count the groups. One, two, three, four. This also has four. This shows me that these two numbers are equal. This group does not have less and it does not have more. It has an equal amount. So I know it is not this one. I'm going to draw an X on it. Now let's count. One, two, three. This group has three. Is that less or fewer than four? Yes, absolutely. So I believe this to be the right answer, but I like to check through every option just to be sure. Let's count these tricycles. One, two, three, four, five. All right, so yes, this is the correct option, three, because it has fewer. This group over here has more because five is larger than four. So it has more in this group. But this group here has fewer. So we're going to choose that group. Okay, now let's count the bicycles. Look at this group of bicycles. Now select the group that shows fewer. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right, I know there are nine bicycles there, so I need to find the group that has fewer. Let's start counting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now let's count this one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There's ten in this one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There's nine in this one. Now let's compare. I know that nine and nine are the same, so those are equal. So this does not have fewer. This group has 10, and I know that 10 is greater than nine or more than nine, so I know that it is not this group. Now let's look at this one. I see that we have eight, and I know that eight comes before nine, which means it is smaller or less than nine. So this group has fewer. So let's choose this one. Amazing work. All right, look at this group of oranges. Now select the group that shows fewer. Well, I can look at this picture and I can see that there are two oranges. And I can see that this group has two oranges, so I know these are equal. So I can already tell it is not going to be my middle option. And I can look over here and see that this group has more because there are three, and I know that three is more than two. So it is not this option either. 
So if it is not this one and is not this one, it would probably be this one. Let's look and make sure. If we have two, is one less than two or fewer than two? Yes, absolutely. So this is the correct option. Now let's count. Look at this group of pictures. Now select the group that shows the same. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I see nine, let's draw a nine. All right, let's count our other groups. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I've already spotted the nine. All right, but again, I would like to count these other ones just to make sure, just in case I miscounted in this group. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I know that's fewer than nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I know that's more than nine. We're looking for the group that shows the same. So here's nine and here's nine. These two groups are the same. Now let's look at the chairs. Look at this group of chairs. Now select the group that shows the same. One, two, three, four. I see four. All right, now let's start counting. One, two, three, four, five. There are five in this group. One, two, three, four. There are four in this group. One, two, three. There are three in this group. Which one shows the same? Yes, this group here. This also has four. Next, they want us to look at this group of ladybugs. Now select the group that shows the same. Well, let's get counting. One, two, three, four, five, six. I see six ladybugs. I'm going to write the number six. Now let's count. One, two, three, four, five. This group has five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This group has seven. One, two, three, four, five, six. This group has six. So they would like us to select the group that shows the same. Do you see a group that's the same as six? Yes, six right here. So let's choose this group. Okay, look at this group of oranges. Now select the group that shows more. Well, I see one, two, three. Okay, I see that this group only has two, so I know that's not more than three. And I see that this one has one, two, three. That's the same as three, so that's not more. It must be this one, let's count. One, two, three, four. Yep, because four is greater than three, it is more. Now, they would like us to look at the sports cars and select the group that shows more. Let's get counting. One, two, three. Wonderful. Let's count the groups. One, two, three. I see that there are three here. And we also had three up here. We're looking for the group that shows more. I know it's not this one because those are the same. One, two, three, four. Oh, here's four. Four is greater than three or is more than three. So here I see that we just have two. So this is the correct option over here. All right, this is our last one. They want us to look at this group of chairs and select the group that shows more. So let's count these chairs. One, two, three, four. Let's find a group that shows more. One, two, three. I know that three is less or fewer than four, so it's not this one. One, two, three, four. Ah, I know that four is the same as four, so it's not this one either. One, two, three, four, five. 
I know that five is more than four, so it is this option. Let's choose this one. Great work today.